Hello students, welcome to Top Scholars. Students, today we're going to learn about Pascal Triangle and its amazing application. Pascal Triangle consists of many rows and each row has a unique pattern. First row starts with one. Now imagine two invisible zeros besides it. The next row you need to add zero and one to make one and then 1 and 0 to get another one. Always put two imaginary zeros at the start and end of each row. To get to the next row, you need to follow the same procedure. You can have infinite rows in a Pascal triangle. But what is so unique about this triangle full of numbers? Well, each row in Pascal triangle forms the coefficient of binomial expansion x plus y raised to the power n. Let's check for the different values of n. When n is 0, we have x plus y raised to the power 0, which equals to 1, which is the first row of Pascal triangle. When n is 1, we have x plus y raised to the power 1 is equal to x plus y, where each term has a coefficient of 1, and that is the second row. For n is equal to 2, x plus y square is equal to x square plus 2xy plus y square, where we have coefficient 1, 2 and 1, and this is the third row of the triangle. So Pascal's triangle helps us with binomial expansion. Not only this, there are many hidden secrets and surprises inside the Pascal's triangle. For example, if we add up the numbers of each row, we get successive powers of 2. Now, if we consider each number in a particular row to be part of a decimal expansion, we get the powers of 11. For example, in row 3, we have 1, 2 and 1, which can be treated as 1 times 100 plus 2 times 10 plus 1 times 1 is equal to 121, which is 11 square. Now, take a look at the fifth row, which has 1, 4, 6, 4, 1, which when written in a decimal expansion gives us 14,641, which is 11 raised to the power of 4. There's more to it. The first diagonal is just a row of 1. The second diagonal is of natural numbers. But the third diagonal is a set of triangular numbers. And the fourth diagonal is of tetrahedral numbers. So students, Pascal's triangle is not just any triangle. It has a lot more application in probability, geometry and combinatorics. Can you find any other hidden secret in this triangle? If yes, do let us know. For more such fantastic videos, follow Top Scholars.